What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, make sure you click that subscribe button to stay up to date with everything that's going on in the backwoods. So last week I ended off with the dethatch and the seeding. So I'm doing this directly after that actually, but the video would have been too long and I don't want you guys getting bored. So this is just a quick one. So what I'm gonna do is overseed and top dress the putting green. So let me just take you on a little walk here. The first thing I do is I take this thing. I don't know if you can see that, but it's got a bunch of nails in it. So I have spots like this that are actually pretty compacted. So before I seed, I always come and I just start jabbing it. It's like aerating it, but this is a little bit finer. It'll help hold the seed in place. It's exactly what I want. And then right here, I got this one stubborn bear spot. It just won't take. I've tried three, three times, three times, and still nothing. There's been minimal growth, but the weather is much more favorable for it now. So I'm just gonna poke this. You can see all those holes. And I'm gonna be spreading almost two pounds of seed, which is way more than what they recommend. But I don't care what you say. I feel I should. I think it's gonna work out. And if it doesn't, if it fails, I'll show you that too. But look at that, it's, it's looking pretty good. All right, so let's get the seed into the spreader. A little handheld, same as before. Got my peat moss spreader right there. Peat moss, I might need two bales. If I do, I'll just go back into the garage and get one. All right, so let's go right, guys. So I'm all loaded up. There is a lot of seed. Don't forget this stuff is extremely small. That's why they call for maybe a thousand or one pound per thousand square feet. I'm using about two for a thousand square feet and most of it's gonna be concentrated on the back end, which is the newer part of the renovation. So with that, let's go and see how it looks. All right guys, so that's all done. It doesn't take long. That took me like three minutes or something like that. But I also just wanted to show you guys this. Look at that. Some maple leaves. Yeah, that's Canada. Winter is coming. Don't let nice weather fool you. So, all right, throw down this peat moss, get it top dressed. Then it's time to set the sprinklers up and do this whole thing, the whole yard, get all the seed down. Hopefully we do get some rain as well to help out, but if not, whatever. Then yeah, let's do this. All right, so this is how it looks after being top dressed with peat moss. You can see the darker spots like that where there's not a whole lot of grass, but everywhere else there is good coverage. I mean, it doesn't look like it now, but give this a week or two and it's gonna look lush coming into fall. All right, so last thing to do, get the sprinkler set up, hit both these lawns with some water, have a beer and relax. This has been Backwoods. We'll see you in the next one.